you smile. You're not the only one who can read people, you know. You know what? It's because of her influence that I'm more sad than pissed off. Because the impact of that story was profound, and I'm not even going to begin to explain it to you. Can you imagine what it felt like to look at her sandals on the floor across the room? Think about what I just thought of them a few hours earlier. And then I'd say her name. She'd say, what? And I'd say her name again. Well, I'm not. I'm not embarrassed. I don't care how well this sounds to you now. I don't. Can you see why I couldn't just let her go? I mean, I just, I grabbed onto her skirt and I begged her not to leave. And then I watched her close the door gently and walk down the hallway and never see her again. It didn't matter that she was fluffy or that she wasn't all that bright. Nothing else mattered. She had all of my attention. I had fallen in love with her. I believed she could save me. Well, I know how this sounds. I can see that look on your face. And I know you. And I know what you're thinking. So ask him. Come on, ask him. This is your chance. Go ahead. I believed she could save me, I said. Ask it. Say something. I sit here naked before you. Say something. Ask it. Judge me, you bitch. Are you all born out? Are you happy now? Well, be happy. I don't care. I knew she could, and I knew I loved.